rainy day. Okay, so I have an alarm system on my house, and I've been having a problem for like two years now, where the keypad by the door, um, when you open and close doors, it's supposed to beep, and when the alarm's set and you open the door, it goes beep, so you know that it's on and you have to type in the code. Uh, well, the little piezo buzzer in there seems to be getting stuff in it. Uh, cause it sounds muffled or you can't hear it at all sometimes. So I'll take the keypad off, unscrew it, and I'll blow compressed air in, into the speaker and it'll work for a couple days and then it sounds muffled again. So it just, just must be something in there. Um, now I could try desoldering the speaker that's on there. Um, but I don't feel like doing that. Uh, but I do have some piezo buzzers, so I'm just going to try to solder one onto the board alongside of the piezo buzzer that's in there. Um, and hopefully that will fix this problem for a dollar. Uh, so this is uh, why soldering, uh, having a simple skill like that, can come in handy. I do, you know, you can fix stuff like this. Because the keypad itself, it's an older model. And I haven't been able to find it for a good price. I've been seeing them used for like $80. And from my understanding, from what I've read, getting a newer model, I might have to replace the whole panel in, in, inside the house that it connects to, which is another $100. And then you have to know how to program that, and I just, I don't want to go through that. So I just want to replace the speaker, so let's give that a try. See, I gotta remember these wires. We got red, black, yellow. Yeah, okay. Actually worked the first try. <laughs>